What's up guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we're gonna to talk about the Raspberry Pi Magic Mirror. If you don't know what that is, check out these two videos up top and they'll kind of give you a good walkthrough. I wanted to show you three modules that I found that will give your mirror a little bit of flair and a little bit more function. So the first one plays really well into the holiday season and to the winter. It's cold here in the Northeast and it snows a lot. So I sort of tied in a weather app that will allow it to snow on the mirror if it was snowing outside. So I'll restart the mirror so that the module can load. And basically it's tied into the weather app, like I said. If it snows outside, it snows here. And so the mirror becomes the first indicator that it's snowing outside, you know, if you're not looking out at the window. So if you'll check now, sort of at the top, you can see up here we have some snowflakes. And I'll do a little picture in picture right here that'll kind of give you a better idea of what it looks like. So that's fun, it gives your mirror a little bit of flavor. The second module is somewhere in the same vein. It plays along with the holiday spirit and it'll kind of help to dress up your mirror a little bit. A lot of people use holiday lights in their house and why not have holiday lights on your mirror? So what we're gonna do is add some red and green holiday lights and we'll restart the mirror so you can get a better idea. It's gonna restart. There we go. Now, this is really cool if you have a party. We have some people over our house once in a while and they always think the mirror is kind of like a neat little focal point for the room. So I thought it'd be fun if I could dress it up in the holiday season and make the mirror fit in with the rest of the house. A lot of tech feels like very dark and gray and it's always sleek, but if you can add a couple things like lights, it's a little bit warmer in your house and it's fun. So this is pretty cool. We have like white, yellow, red Christmas lights strung along the top of the mirror. Like I said, it's fun if you have a party, you have people over, and if you have kids, they love that too because it's just another fun thing that you can add to something in your house. The last thing I wanna show you is very, very functional if you're commuting to work. So here in the Northeast, it snows a lot and your commute gets snarled and you're not sure when you wanna leave. So I found a travel module that'll tell you when you have to leave your house in order to get to work on time. So it'll look a bit like this. And so I'm doing all these on my Mac Pro right now. I'm logging into the Raspberry Pi and I'm just sort of revealing each of the modules as we talk about them. So that's why I'm looking down. My laptop is right here. And so the traffic will look something like this. So the way this works is you pick an origin address. So I chose Times Square and you pick a destination address and I chose work. So we'll say Times Square is home. The World Trade Center is work. You say you wanna get there at 8 a.m. Using the Google API, this little function here will tell you when you want to leave in the morning. If you're like us and you're rushing around the house, you can just glance at the mirror and you know exactly when you gotta leave in order to get to work on time. So now this is set to driving and you can see up there on the top that it's saying right now 726. So basically that's saying on Monday morning, you need to leave by 726 if you're leaving from Times Square and you want to get to the World Trade Center at 8 a.m. You can change any address you'd like. This is set to driving, so you could certainly do the subway, and it would just pick the closest subway station and tell you when you need to leave in order to get to work on time. So these are just three helpful modules that I thought would give your mirror a little bit more function, a little bit more flair. If you guys like these Raspberry Pi videos, comment below and let me know so I can make more of them. And as always, if you wanna stay up to date on the latest videos, don't forget to tap like and to hit that subscribe button and ring the bell.